Hi everybody, it's Ollie Wedgwood here and welcome to Improvisation for Beginners video 3. In the last video we saw how wrong notes are in fact right notes waiting to happen and one point that I didn't mention is that wrong notes can give you a new idea, new ideas. They can be creative stepping stones. Um, so don't be afraid of them, they're there to help us. Here's the link to that last video if you missed it. In this video, I'm going to share with you a very important piece of the improvising jigsaw puzzle. Knowing what you want to play. Now, in jazz, there are two main aspects to improvising. There's first of all knowing what you want to play. And those are the musical ideas, the me melodies, the, the, uh, the, the tunes that you have in your head that you think might fit the present moment. And then there's knowing how to play those melodies, or those musical ideas, on your chosen instrument. And that's like knowing the language, or the, what I call the framework, and how to speak it on your instrument. And we'll be talking more about that in future videos. But this video is all about knowing what you want to play. So the first of these, knowing what you want to play, is is often overlooked by a lot of musicians, a lot of jazz musicians, but it will make your improvising richer and more satisfying. I once went to a jazz course, uh, wanted to improve my improvising, and uh, one of the sessions was with an amazing jazz pianist, and uh, he started by showing us an improvisation, and after a few minutes, I realized that actually all he was doing was running up and down very fast, uh, jazz scales, complicated scales, but it was very mechanistic. There was no melody, there was no kind of ideas there. And uh, so that told me, that showed me in hindsight that he perhaps hadn't spent much time developing the knowing what he wanted to play. So it's really important that you start developing your musical ideas from day one. And this is actually really fun, relaxing and uh, enjoyable. All you need to do is listen to different types of music for a few minutes each day. And perhaps you already do this. Um, if you do, fantastic. I know that personally I get to the end of a week and realize that I actually haven't spent much time listening to music, new music. Um, so it's um, something which is easy not to do as well. By listening to new music, you're going to naturally absorb uh, melodic ideas and store them for future use in your improvising. Now you might say, isn't this just copying? And actually, yeah, it is. But think about how you learn to speak a language. Well, you first speak it by copying. And so all the words I'm speaking now, or the notes that you improvise with, for example, all the words I'm speaking are spoken by other people hundreds and millions of times before, but I'm putting my own spin on my own spin on it. My, the dynamics, the inflections, the staccato, the smoothness. You can do all of that with the musical ideas that you have, putting them in the order that you want to deliver them. I hope that makes some sense. So it's said that 21 days is all you need to uh, establish a habit and we need to make a habit of this if we're going to get those musical ideas in our heads. So I've got a 21 day listening challenge for you. Each day, if you're up for the challenge that is, I will email you a link to a piece of music from YouTube and all you have to do is listen to it. Easy as that. The tracks I send you will include the jazz greats and some others um, but all of the tracks will contain essential melodic ideas that you can then absorb and remember and use uh, in future for your improvising. So, the question is, are you up for the challenge? So, subscribe to the challenge by clicking this link here. Um, you'll need to enter your email address. Um, I'll send you uh, your first 
a bit of music to listen to immediately and then each day after that there'll be a new link to listen to. Uh, it'd be great to hear how you get on if you manage to succeed in the 21 day challenge. Uh, I look forward to hearing how it goes. All the best and I will speak soon.